Okay, this is Wolfbane Blitz back when Hunter Call of the Wild. <clears throat> I'm gonna go to this uh, marker here, and uh, I'm sure I'm gonna have to do some duck hunting. So I'll just use my uh, drilling rifle. Probably take the scope off of it when I do it, but uh, it's a shotgun too, so. Uh, well, what are you doing? Uh, and use it because I've already got bird shot in it. And do some cinnamon teal hunting, I guess. And when I get there, or if I uh, run on something else beforehand, I'll be back. Our buck. Uh, not bad. Should be a pretty good one. He's heading right toward our marker, too. Or at least right now he is. Yeah. traveling with those does or just kind of skirting them or what Hit. Oh, there's a mountain lion somewhere. Where are you at, dude? Stand. I have no clue where that cat's at. I don't know how aggressive they are. we were tracking, wasn't it? I'd say. Well, maybe not either. What's that? Oh, that's him. Laying right there. Well, he didn't go nowhere, did he? I'm sure. Pretty sure, anyway. That's the best muley I've taken. sound too happy at all. Okay. 
This guy is. Oh man. Kind of a big wild looking dude, ain't he? a young lady named Beatriz Cabrera to leave this hunting party. Beatriz is a gaucha, born and raised on the land, tougher than most men, and the apple of my nephew's pistenses eye. I taught Beatriz to shoot myself, so the party will be in good hands. In case she needs anything, I gave her your number. If she reaches out, help her if you have the time. Okay. You say so, lady. Let's see what I gotta do about the ducks. Lago Peron is just ahead. Set up the hunting location. Set up decoys. I try to place those in a natural grouping. Thank you. You mention a little gunslinger. Now we have an urgent problem. The fan belt on the generator that powers the lodge site is busted. Perhaps it was sabotaged by an energy salesman. I'll worry about that. You worry about getting the power back on so the crew can continue working. Unfortunately, we are a long way from the nearest hardware store, but as we say, lo atamos con alambre, you know, improvise, like MacGyver. Try salvaging a fan belt from the site mark on your hunter mate. That's an old excavator left behind by a mining operation decades ago. Okay. You are now near the first site where I plan to build the lodge, but my nephew convinced me to select a more central location. He was right, I think, but it's more difficult to get supplies to the middle of the reserve. Case in point, now. I could have it removed, but there's something I like about it. It represents the failures of those who would have destroyed this place, had Fernando and I not rescued from them. Pelotudos. Their loss is our gain. See if you can salvage an appropriate fan bell. Buena, vamos, 
back to the lodge. Okay, I got a fan belt off an old, I call it, yeah, I guess, yeah, that be an excavator, yeah. Old style, cable one. Another mule deer. Don't look too bad. many points. Silver. Three by three. That's kind of a cool looking rack though. Some belt to the generator. How are your mechanical skills? Can you fix it yourself?
la leche. Yo estoy en el horno. Tranquila, Carolina, tranquila. This isn't your fault. It's my fault. The silver lining is that now we have no choice but to set up a more sustainable power source. I wanted solar power, but let me tell you, wind turbine saves people are persistent. This one guy claims he can save me packs of cash. Personally, I don't think there's enough wind here. Neither does Vicente. For the sake of due diligence, can you test these salesman's claims? Collect the wind gauges at the front of the lodge. Set the wind gauges at the locations marked on your hunter mail. We need to leave these gauges up for a while before you can collect the data. You've been working hard. Treat yourself to a hand. There's plenty of game in the region. See what you can find. Some moment. Yeah. Here. She's down, ain't she? I think so. The female. Where does that sound travel from, man? I wonder. Getting closer to
take a shot at him yet. I'll have to take it with a rifle. Oh, cougar. I don't care if it's female or not. It's the first one I've even seen. Oh, man! If I hit it, I hit it right in the butt. <laughs> man, that could be bad. That kind of worked up. I kind of got buck fever on that one. Hope I missed. Let's <laughs> go we'll pick up our dough muley. And I'll check that. Oh man. I hope I missed. <laughs> Well done. You bagged yourself a trophy just in time to collect that wind gauge data. Head back to the gauges. I will after I check this cat. <laughs> yeah, here she is. Now oh, that's a male there. This her? No. It's a deer. Maybe she was farther out than that one was. Deer. Here she is, I think. Yeah. Ah, Bucky, hang on. Yeah, I think I missed her. Yeah, I missed. Good. Good, I missed her. Now this one's just bleeding, no tracks, so... Now, now he's finally leaving some tracks. Well, 
There he is. That thing glowing up there. That's how he's a bronze. Four by four, ain't he? he? Might make silver. No, bronze. Ooh, <laughs> hit him in her rear. Yeah. That is weird. Well, who didn't you know it? That salesman wasn't lying after all. Our winds are in the optimum range for turbines. We could even produce a surplus of power to sell off locally. Bigger than the surplus we might get from solar. The thing is, I've waited for decades to open this reserve. Now that we are this close, every minute we delay is agony. So while we were waiting on that wind data, I ordered solar panels anyway. Impulsive maybe, but wind turbines take too long to build. I simply couldn't take the chance that our VIP guests would arrive to a lodge without power. I even paid for emergency rush shipping so our solar panels were just airdrop next to the lake. Before I send a team out to retrieve them, can you confirm their arrival? The shipping receipt says my solar panel should be in the area ahead of you. Do you see the solar panel? No? I hope some Boludo pilot didn't screw up the drop. My nephew marked the plane's flight path on your hunter mate. Search that area, find those panels. I haven't been to church since the 80s, but I'm praying to St. Anthony that you find those missing panels. Don't give up, you have to be getting close. my solar panel. Huh? Maybe St. Anthony did the trick after all. I'll send a crew to that location to retrieve them. I'm saying. Sounds like everything is dead except for some cabling which probably blew further of course. The wind must resent that we are going solar but they might also point us in the right direction. My nephew Mark and Eddie on your hunter made where he thinks you should look. <sighs> what galls me is we had an account with this freight company for years. Whoever this drunken mess of a pilot is, missing his drops by whole kilometers, he's finished. We'll see to that. Water Buffalo. That ain't bad, is it?
Oh, there's a water buffalo on this map. Our missing package yet? You can be part of, unlike our pilot. We don't have time to wait. I want you to shoot that package down, and hopefully, nearby, water buffalo won't charge you. I promise you, Che, this pilot, this fellow Dudo, is going to pay for putting you at risk like this. Shoot, red. Wait until the water buffalo disperse, or find a way to disperse them yourself before you retrieve the package. They're already gone. Uh oh, thought they were. Hey. I run back across. Where you at? Oh crap. Oh. Still hear you. Where'd he go? That type sucker. Blood go. I've seen blood earlier. There. Bleed right low. There's an easy trick to hunting water buffalo that a surprising number of people miss. Water buffalo love water. If any guests ever ask you where to find them, send them to the lakes and swamps. Water buffalo are vital for containing and controlled vegetation growth in the reserve, especially during wet seasons. And they're meaty. Fantastic. Our local beef is world class. But if you ask me, I still prefer buffalo. Where did you? Is that it? Yep, it does. Good one, I think. Gold. Left link, man, yeah, I did hit him. 
good. Oh, all right, dude. Good grief, that's weird. Beloved Fernando is smiling down on us. You know, he and I planned to open this place all the way back in 1983, but then he died. And one thing after another got in the way of opening. I had a family to pull together, businesses to run. Everybody doubted me, doubted I could manage it all without Fernando. Every time I spent money to improve the park, his Boludo's brothers laughed and called me Doña Quixote. Too bad none of them live to see this day. If I am Quixote, you are my panza. And by opening this park, we have fought a giant and won. But this is only the start of our adventures together, yes. For one thing, we need to put finishing touches on this lodge. I am the patroness for a local artisan. Goes by Mad Mad. He's not your ordinary taxidermist. More of a miracle worker with flesh and bones. He can turn most any deer hide into the softest rock imaginable. Exactly what we need for our lodge. Harvest a mule deer or a red deer, and I'll have Mad Mad make a world class rock. World class. Okay, so I gotta. Take a mule deer or red deer, anything like what she said. Next, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna call this a hunt, and uh, I'll, you know, I, I put a video out just prior to this one, and I don't know. Sometimes my thumbnails that don't want to. Uh, upload a video with the thumbnail it'll always sit you know it'll give me that it errored you know had an error and it won't put up the thumbnail when I do it I don't know what that deal is I don't know if it's my internet or or water but uh, that's why you know I've only got I think one since I started doing thumbnails for this get particular game with a thumbnail, I'm going to try and put one on this one. Hopefully it'll work. And I'm trying to work through these missions. And some of them just seem like they just go on forever, but I want to get them out of the way and so I don't have to mess with that stuff. And uh, But I'm also wanting to, thinking about starting another channel with... Uh, just real stuff you know not gaming maybe have some of my hunting and other stuff that I do uh, 
so I'm thinking about doing that so that might be coming up pretty soon that'll be uh, under Jeff Calhoun instead of Wolfbane Blitz but uh, I don't know how long that'll take me to get you know enough stuff going to where I can uh, do that but I'm going to call this one a, a hunt and a video and I've got a lot of editing to do on this one. I mean a lot of editing. So I will see you the next time and if you would uh, give it a like, subscribe to my channel. It helped me out a lot and I will see you later.